Legacy Model VP. Naku, lakad mo. Lakad mo na lang. Lakad mo na to. Mars, oh, TA. So, <laughs> we mentioned like seven carries. Yeah. <laughs> Got none. Not that one. Oh, well. Late game oriented compared to Temple Assassin. Salad. He's in trouble. He's dead. Yeah, very dead on his screen. Arrow hits and will die to Monet. Not the first blood you want to give up in this situation. And uh, Monet. When I say first blood, I mean like the real first blood, not the one that happened. Uh... <laughs> I, I don't count it. Not the real first blood, the yeah, next yeah, first. Yeah. Second blood. The laning stage first blood. Pick you, getting run down, so is Salad. Salad might die for the second time, and that will be after the Moran is taken out by Zhao Yu. So... I guess he thought he could get through those threes. Usually it's cut down by your carry with the Calling Blade, so you can pull the big camp if it's open. He's gonna be a cookie on a creep or something like that. He'll end up dead, but instead, they'll go the other way. They'll dive into the tower and get LWW easily. Nothing really stopping them. There's not really anything MKS can do. These stacks here. And from there, they might want to go over and have somebody try to take those stacks and not really give them up to E-Home. Asian stack might be a difficult one to take for E-Home. Cookie. Yeah, going in and there was a, a look of potentially going with the Rolling Thunder, but XWY Avalanche tree toss to get the kill on LWW who was over there. and. Another kill going the way of this tiny. To go back to stacks, MKS does have Morbid Mask finished. Uh, they can farm the big stack, but I don't think they can. But uh, since he was stacking a lot, not going to be level 6. He always has uh, two heroes to play with in this game. With Mortimer's Kisses, they're going to find LWW. They, they saw him going under that sentry. So now he'll morph into the tiny. Avalanche comes out. LWW is going to be killed off. And now they got the damage with the Rolling Thunder to lock down XWI. Primal Roar was used, but it doesn't get them anything. So off that invis, well, under the sentry and immediately dead. Is uh, staying on top of the network with his farm. Kind of imagine what it would have been like if he had taken those ancient stacks, but I think you're, with the way the lane went, you're more than okay with XXS getting a free 14 minute helm of the Overlord. And here comes Zhao Yu Arena, but right into an avalanche toss. MKS morphs, they've got the spear, XWY dies. LWW will fall in tandem with Knight. So two heroes dead on the side of E-Home. They'll go after Salad. They've got the cookie. They'll lock down the cot on the melt strike. Triple kill for Monet. Farm or not, he's getting the kills. They're under the Moonlight Shadow and won't get the finishing blow on Picky. Ristol also dropped, but that, I mean, it does look like a pitchfork. Oh, you know, that's a dagger. <laughs> oh, they'll go. The spear. Oh, the arena. The combo's not there. Primal Roar and then the ancient Granite Golem just wailing on these heroes. They've got two rocks that are hitting away at them with Tiny and the Ancient Granite Golem, but they'll take out the Granite Golem, they'll get Ikiyu, and they'll look for the Mortimer's Kisses that are stopped thanks to the Spike Carapace. Meld Strike, Avalanche, on to LWW, the cookie to get further in, they take out the Nyx Assassin, morph into the Tiny, Avalanche hits Monet and XWY. It's a double kill for XXS right now. They are staying on E-Home, maybe a little bit too close. You gotta understand. Lotus Orb for himself to reflect, roar back to Beastmaster. Ooh. Midnight, BKB, toss up into the air, and that means he's not getting out with the BKB there for XWY. They have the control, LWW, no spike carapace. This time the kisses do the work. No, it's actually still Monet that gets the kill. And he drops the gem back oh, to Bobaka. Salad. He bought back 67 seconds, Roche respawning. Is Rune. This didn't work out for the last team that tried to bait a Rune. Let's see if it works out for them this time. The arena's up, they're yeah, going, get the kill on XWY, so it's going to start out pretty well. The Rolling Thunder is going to be stopped to the Primal Roar. Obaka still caught inside the arena. The gem's on the deck, but they get it into the hands of Pikyu. They start to leave on the side of E-Home. Kisses. Oh, night. Dead. He'll go to sleep with a good night kiss. That trap slowing him down. Buyback from XW. Oh, up on the high ground, blink down low. Toss, Avalanche hitting on two. They've got the axes coming over, and the damage on LWW to get the kill. On a one, at least. It's 18,000 net worth lead. No real punch back from E-Home. They also proc the undisc con Pango. He's trying to protect himself against Beastmaster, Primal Roar, and Templar Assassin overwhelming damage. And now without E on this, he just might die. 
They'll go in. They've got the arena. It's around on floor with BKBs being popped around by all three cores on the side of Aston. They'll turn it around with the Primal Roar onto Zhao Yu. They've got themselves one kill. They look at MKS. The cookie is perfect. And MKS drops. He's dead for 52. He's got five back and probably worst, the highest authority of uh, jokes. Bubble Cow will break the smoke on the high ground, but they know where he is. Spear, BKB, Primal Roar, all the way out. Xiao Yu, poof! See ya! They get that kill on a Xiao Yu. They'll look over at MKS. You fought back before? Well, you're dead again, sir. They might call LWW it. falls. Knight with a TP out. Aeon Disc, he'll survive and back into the base. Bubble Cow, what a spot to be in. They try to. Defense. Is tough. There goes the tier three tower. And another set of racks. Avalanche tossed up into the air. Melt strike. Take him out. And GG. Yeah, I mean, it, a little bit anticlimactic, but at the end of the day, Monet with the perfect game. And uh, Aster overall just dominating the side of V-Home. They had a look at the fast kill. It's right. over the draw. They all the way back. The deal was, especially with no second hero, the creep wave not near, they had a chance to get a kill if they maybe put it together a little bit better. Rubik might be in trouble. Oh, they also do see Zhao Yu. Uh, Storm Hammer on both. Stun. That means LSA on both. Oh, they're going to get themselves the Marcy. Now they look for Salad. Telekinesis will keep him alive. LWW. Oh, oh, Remnant's back. Outplayed. <laughs> XWY getting a solo kill there on the Disruptor. Leaving the lane open right now for Bobica, who's sitting level five. Should be able to get to an earlier six. And he's got 900 gold saved up. So can only assume when that mech's going to get here is pretty soon. Storm Hammer, Telekinesis, but a Laguna Blade and a right click from Monet to get another kill. Aster already 3,000 net worth ahead, and they're going bottom. They want MKS. There's nowhere for him to go except around these trees and into the creeps. He's blocked for a moment. XWY now here with Bobica and XXS. The First duel, duel the Illuminate, and the winner winner, Chicken Dinner. This is also going to be a tower. I'm a little surprised that MKS decided to stay bottom. Usually, Draw Rangers want to get uh, six, get out of the lane. He's level seven, so he did have a casual glove. Oh, LSA hits as they jump in. They want Monet. They don't have the Unleash's time, so the damage is really lacking. Zhao Yu needs to now leave. They've got Laguna Blade. If they can find themselves, the Marcy may not even need it. The Illuminate just misses. The wings don't clip, but Marcy's wings Dragonite. may be clipped out as they're trying to get out of this one with rebound. Knight ends up dying. Zhao Yu able to just survive rebounding out. It was only with Bovica who oh, I say that. did have a spirit flight. Spirit chains to kill off Xiao Yu. Keeper of the gets together with Pikyu and uh, are you a little surprised that maybe Aster aren't looking for a fight again or do they will now. Now that Legion Commander picked up the blink dagger, they're definitely gonna go look for something. And Rubik sounds like a juicy one. Blink, dual, storm hammer, the damage is there. They'll get another victory, this time with an extra eight damage thanks to the level ten talent. And that is now 38 damage for XXS, but Knight going the other way. He's got the Dragon Tail, the Static Storm committed. Sven's pretty tanky, the right clicks in from the Lina. Knight needs to run the Storm Hammer, the kill for Monet. And Knight jumps into darkness. Pretty similar to previous game, Soul Charges. So it should be able to bring it down. Bobica unleash. Oh no. Xiao Yu. Oh, the rebound. He gets the kill, that's, but that's, that's going to cost his life. That's the best thing he could have done. And Bobokat tips Zhao Yu. He knew that Bobokat's going to be very greedy. Stay Try by. to stay, stay close. Maybe he gets the last hit. On Static Storm committed onto the Sven now, but where is your damage? The glimpse, the duel. Do they have the victory? No. <laughs> Stolen Warcry from Rubik. This is also relative. Passive, so you get the... Passive six, plus you get the extra 15. Monet, more cry. BKB, another duel and another victory. He is undefeated. Just bringing him into the arena and asking the crowd, are you not entertained? As they go after this Rubik, Salad steals the Storm Hammer, throws it back onto the Sven. But again, where's the damage? It's from the multi-shot of MKS. 
The right clicks from Monet. They've got the silence on a two. They should be able to get the kill on a knight. He's up onto the high ground, but the remnant forward. Now MKS over to the side of the storm hammer that was stolen. Now thrown back on XWY. Sight of fist, searing chains on a two. Blinding light, hitting three, going for more. And MKS is gonna drop. It's looking like they're gonna get everybody on the side of E-Home. As Aster go back down the steps as a TP comes through from the Marcy, wanting to fight again. But Xiao Yu, do you have the damage? Dispose XWI the right clicks, the unleash XWY with a sight of fist, but now ruining the trouble. Duel. There's the duel again from XXS. You come into my arena, you will lose. LWW on the run from XXS. It's a battle of the three letter names, and XXS will be the victor. And this fight has been going on for more than a minute. Uh, XXS duel. Duel for them is uh, another, oh, another duel. Another duel. Oi! BKB, there's the duel. Is the damage in the blind light and the right clicks? Sure, it's more than enough. Glimpse back, but can they look for more? They've got XXS. LWW will TP out. And with that duel victory, 168 duel damage for XXS. Plus some extra region coming up from that press the attack. Now he actually bought bots. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> like <laughs> he can join the fight faster. Yeah. Ne next axe, right? Right, Bobica. Come on. When was the last time you saw bots too even built? This is the fastest bots do. <laughs> Most definitely. Side of fist searing chains. Uh oh, that means a duel's in your future. And that means a duel victory is in XXS's future. You're unleashing XXS because he's coming after you, Zhao Yu, and you cannot fight back. LWW will end up dead. Zhao Yu falls to XXS. Down goes Salad. Bobuk is here because he's got bots too. I would not be surprised if they called the a game. Yeah, it is, uh. Yeah. All right. You're not wrong, and uh, neither is Ehome for calling it here. Aster just destroying them. I that was that was a, the cleanest performance of the DP.